escape. Who are you? I already told you I don't want to be with you anymore. You, you. Hello world and welcome to another one of my videos. Today I'm reacting to Debbie and Usama. To be with the man of my dreams, my Osama. Usama being the Moroccan. <laughs> Osama being the Moroccan from the new 90 Day Fiancé season, actually it's 5 episodes already. Whew. I had 1 hour of sleep, I feel extremely toxic. Let's get into it. Oh god. Osama. I got to get this dress up, I keep stepping on it. Careful Debbie, you're this close to... Osama didn't marry you yet, come on now. Where's the insurance? I'm supporting Osama because by supporting Osama, I support Moroccan, eco <laughs> Moroccan economy and that's where I come from. So Debbie goes up the stairs, Debbie goes I'm falling and I can't get up. Osama's bank account goes poop. Morocco's economy goes poop. This is business. This is my sweat. I know, but I did business. Shut up. It's all proportional. I like thick women. Get some help. Why are they playing French music for Debbie? Turns out France is known for romance and fashion and old, very, very old wine. Osama has to fit in here too. It's like, dang, man, why they don't make these carry-ons a little bit bigger? Packing has been a freaking nightmare. I hope it doesn't bust. I feel sorry for the TSA agents going through my suitcases. They're going to say, what is wrong with this woman? I overdo my carry-on. I said to myself, oh, I'm going to do it better. I'm going to make it lighter. Well, guess what? It's even heavier than it was last but time. But why are you packing in there? Hopes and dreams? I hate packing. It literally gets so heavy so quick. You add this feather, literal feather, to the suitcase. Boom, one kilo. Then if I diet for two fucking months, I, I lose 200 grams. Yo, kill me with this Osama. <laughs> there we go. Today, I'm moving to Morocco to be with the man of my dreams, my Osama. Ah. Okay, well, it's not, it's not the most brightest thing to start the scene with him skating. Skate your way into employment, maybe. Osama. My name is Osama, my age is Go back to skating. I, I, actually, it suited you so much better. Just go back to skating. I don't, I don't, I don't want to judge. I don't, I don't want to judge. 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 Four years old and 11. Can you start my book? Okay, so he's one of those Khmisat people. From what I know about Khmisat people, they're nice. When someone, I mean, asked me about Khmisat, I told them, if you want to die, go to die there. <laughs> What, 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 how, how is that an introduction to your city? Why am I discussing that with you? Osama. I described as a myself bot? as alone. Uh, I can't, I can't hate, I can't hate. Shit, I have so much in common already. He likes cats, I like cats. He's a loner, I'm a loner. Do you hate camels? Comfortable with cats. Some giants more than people because cats, <laughs> uh, they have silence and they can talk in silence and they can. Okay, well that's weird. Look, even the cat is, his ears are going behind. Comfortable with cats. Some giants more than people because cats, <laughs> uh, they have silence and they can talk in silence and they can feel you in the right way, not like people. Cat does not like you. <laughs> to put it in lamer terms, like, uh, look at this dude. Look at the shape of his teeth. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Feel you in the right way, not like people. Why are you speaking about feeling cats? You're a little sus. Osama. Thank you, you have a cat mm. in your bag. Yeah. Ah, you feel. <laughs> well, that's cute.
How are you? How are you doing? I'm Berber, and uh, the Berber culture is the oldest uh, culture in Morocco. What the fuck? So am I. I am half Berber, actually. I don't like it. So much in common. Hmm. I really don't like you. I don't like you, Osama. That could have been me. If I didn't start a YouTube channel, that could... <laughs> <laughs> that could have been me. As a Muslim, I like my religion and is a part of my identity. Okay. This cow is like dying last month. But she, she could save, I mean, God save her. My family has a farm. It is a small one with like uh, three calves. Like, uh... Okay, this is now, now getting out of hand. I literally... Mm, the, the Instagram folks know that I have... Maybe put some time into a farm with my dad and I was a little invested before moving to Europe. Shit! Osama. I like to work in the farm because, you know, we just you and animals and your father and silence too. <laughs> I don't have a job and just stay home, stay alone because how the work can kill the creations. <laughs> That's a new excuse. Hard work kills creation, huh? Elon Musk, all the things he created, and, and, and not because of hard work, because dedication, blessed. I'm writing a poem about Dibi. What, Dibi? You are a revelation, a full moon, a tree, and a rose. How can a tree and a rose be the same thing? How can a tree and a rose be the same thing? Yeah, they're plants. Go, go figures. Are you vegan too? <laughs> what would Debbie be? Yeah, a tree maybe. Yeah, they live, they live too long. <laughs> Why am I being such an asshole? I am so sorry. Get jealous when you walk beside me. The sun gets jealous when you walk beside me. Why would that? Why would the sun get jealous of Debbie over you? Inside of me there is a writer and a planter and a poet. All of them at the same time? <laughs> okay, 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 okay. Enough with the dad jokes. Enough, 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 enough. Restart, restart. Called Make Wild after a season of loneliness. I write uh, my poetry in English to reach more people because all the world now using English as a first language in the world. Okay, but so only your face you write it for the internet, not for yourself. I write poetry too in Arabic. Subscribe, ya habibi. Time and give my house a vitamins of love. All my art and all my works. Well, that's nice. Sadness, melancholy, misery, and I mean, all the things can help the humans. I know that there is a madness inside of me that I show it in my poetry and in my painting. Okay, well, the madness part I don't agree with. The art is nice. I, like, <sighs> it's okay to be an artist and a poet. Capitalize on it, make some money off of it, become successful artist and a poet. And even if you can't make money, at least you're trying, you know? So nobody can tell you, ah, you're unemployed. At least you're trying. So good job. Follow your dreams. Jesus Christ. Before I meet DB, I didn't uh, look for any girlfriends. Just, I mean, wanted to be alone. Just okay, said... why are you taking a picture with a house alert, with a, ho with a home alert, with a probation band? And try to go sometimes if there is someone who can understand me or someone who can love me truly as I am. And so DB comes to my way. I know that DB is very older than me, but I believe she's okay. also he claims to be Muslim and that's big part of his identity. Hmm, so let me pose behind bottles of wine. What could go, what could possibly go wrong? It's a number and the soul never grows. Shut the fuck up. And if there is a feeling or something between two persons is between the souls, it's not the bodies. Okay, go data 14 years old and let's see how this will age in court. Age, age is just a number. And people will tell me, but same, 18 is legal. So as a lot of things back in the days were legal. You could literally go take some money, buy bananas. Hiya. Not everything that is legal is okay. Although maybe, maybe they are cute. I'm, I'm not gonna judge. Samit and Jenny were cute too. What the fuck? Osama, I'm a free bird stuck in your cage beside your heart. You fed me the love. She texted him. This poem is a hug. Okay. We take like one week, okay, five days, cute. and after we talk and we fix. 
It's happened to us always before. DB is coming to Morocco. I mean, very soon. <laughs> <laughs> of course, it's Facebook. <laughs> what did you? What did I expect? Facebook. Since I see which come because I feel like I miss her too much. But before uh -huh. me and DB get married, I, I need some time to know each other more in reality. Okay. But why did you say that in Arabic? You literally glitched my brain, you pigeon fuck. I was like uh, understanding and then I'm not understanding anymore. I'm like, what? And then I'm subconsciously understanding. So he said, I can't tell Debbie that I don't want to marry her anymore. I, I don't know why. I don't know why. Maybe they have two cows and a goat. I'm not the one to judge, okay? But he's not getting married to Debbie. I feel like this video will get so many dislikes. I apologize. I, I'm making an apology already. I'm so sorry for my behavior. One hour of sleep. That's all I had. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Down below. Yes. I miss you. See you on the next video about uh, Mahmoud and whatever her name is. Mahmoud and Daniel. <laughs> Peace.